Hello and welcome to the session. I am Deepika here. Let's discuss a question which says, given that E and F are events such that probability of E is equal to 0.6, probability of F is equal to 0.3 and probability of E intersection F is equal to 0.2. Find probability of E upon F and probability of F upon E. Let us first understand conditional probability. If E and F are two events associated with the same sample space of a random experiment, the conditional probability of the event E given that F has occurred, that is probability of E upon F is given by probability of E upon F is equal to probability of E intersection F upon probability of F provided probability of F is not equal to 0. So this is a key idea behind our question. We will take the help of this key idea to solve the above question. So let's start the solution. Now we are given probability of E is equal to 0 0.6, probability of F is equal to 0 0.3 and probability of E intersection F is equal to 0 0.2. So we are given probability of E is equal to 0 0.6 probability of f is equal to 0 0.3 and probability of e intersection f is equal to 0 0.2 now we have to find probability of e upon f and probability of f upon e now according to our key idea we know that probability of E upon F is equal to probability of E intersection F upon probability of F provided probability of F is not equal to 0. Now here we have probability of E intersection F is equal to 0 0.2. And probability of F is equal to 0 0.3. So, probability of E upon F is equal to 0 0.2 upon 0 0.3. Now, this is again equal to 2 over 3. Again, probability of F upon E is given by the formula probability of F intersection E upon probability of E provided probability of E is not equal to 0 since probability of F intersection E is equal to probability of E intersection F. Therefore, probability of F upon E is equal to 0 0.2 over probability of E which is 0 0.6 and this is again equal to 1 over 3. So we have probability of E upon F is equal to 2 over 3 and probability of F upon E is equal to 1 over 3. So this is the answer for the above question. This completes our session. I hope the solution is clear to you. Bye and have a nice day.